Hello everyone. This is the daily devotional video for November 9th, 2017. Our passage for today is in the book of Colossians, chapter 3, verses 1 through 3. If then you were raised with Christ, seek those things which are above, where Christ is, sitting at the right hand of God. Set your mind on things above, not on things on the earth. For you died, and your life is hidden with Christ in God. The title for today's devotional is Our Thoughts, Who's in Control. Do you ever struggle with thoughts that you know you shouldn't have? Perhaps you sometimes allow your mind to drift over into unforgiveness, pride, lust, or anger. Attitudes and feelings that you know are not good. How do you tend to respond when this happens? We live in a time and culture that continuously bombard our mind with information through radio and TV broadcasts, movies, newspapers, and the internet. Sometimes a message is good, but often it isn't. And the truth is that our thinking affects us more than we may realize, shaping us into who we are becoming. Thoughts reap actions. Actions reap habits. Habits reap character and our character reaps our destiny. In today's reading, the Apostle Paul urges believers to keep seeking. In other words, we need to habitually seek Christ and continually set our mind on things above. Scripture reassures us that we can, we can control our thoughts by relying on the Lord. It says to see 2 Corinthians 10.5. If we continually look to God for help with how we think, he will mold our heart and shift our attention from materialistic, ungodly priorities to more wholesome spiritual values. Reference to Philippians 4.8. The moment we place our trust in Jesus, we become brand new people. That is the basis for our capacity to think correctly, <clears throat> that is to think more like Christ, and therefore make wise decisions in life. This doesn't mean we will always think right thoughts, but we now have the responsibility and power through the Holy Spirit to steer our mind in a heavenly direction. Wow. Hope you guys have a blessed day. I love you so much. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you back here again tomorrow.